Hey, but he wants to play Rook H6 check. Rook H6 check, come on, what's going on? This is extraordinary, Kasparov managing to keep chances alive just when it's, you think the position's it's over. It's murky, it's murky, but what can you do with E4 followed by Rook H6 with some sort of perpetual play? F5. F5. That's cutting things down. Good move. D4. D4. Get those D4s going. It's, it's Kasparov's managed to get incredible And now how is, how is Rook F4, Queen E7, he just wants to play Queen takes pawn on E4. And, and with a material advantage here, Queen gets Bishop and Knight. But Kasparov fighting for his life here. How about D3, Queen takes E4, D2, Rook takes D2, Rook check, Knight F1 check, and Knight takes Rook on D2. Well, this is maybe possible. Kasparov glancing at the clock, he's under a minute. But Hanand only has 47 seconds left. 47 and is 55, 54, incredible stuff. Rook H6 check, King goes to G3. Can he find a move then? You're a bit restricted. Let's play Rook H6, King G3, Knight. F1, knight one what's this? It's your rook. rook. Rook F4. Maybe if white's threatening rook G4, that would be end of the world. Rook G4 and wins. Rook G4, that looks over. And he's resigned. Extraordinary. <laughs>